Now, it's a potentially monumental breakthrough in science. Researchers from South Korea and the United States say they've figured out a way to edit DNA in human embryos to remove an inherited heart disorder and did so without introducing any harmful mutations. Park ji won with more. Researchers at Korea's Institute for Basic Science, America's Oregon Health and Science University, and the Salk Institute have jointly used a technique involving CRISPR-Cas9, a type of gene editing tool to correct a genetic mutation for hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. The heart disorder affects one in every 500 people and leads to the heart suddenly stopping. Those who have the mutation have a 50-50 chance of passing it on their children. For the study, which was published in the latest issue of the scientific journal Nature, defective sperm were injected into eggs from a healthy woman, and CRISPR-Cas9 was used to correct the genetic flaw. CRISPR-Cas9 works as a pair of molecular scissors that can selectively trim away unwanted parts of the genome and replace them with new stretches of DNA, and the result shows the genetic repair happened at the moment of conception. Although it didn't work every time, the results show that over 70 percent of embryos successfully removed the disease, while other 27 percent of the embryos turned out to have further unexpected mutations due to the experiment. The study was conducted in the U.S. as Korea's law prohibits genetic modification of human embryos. The Korean scientists instead were in charge of the CRISPR-Cas9 technology and analysis of the results. There have been previous attempts to use the gene editing technology in China, but results were mixed and there were a number of safety concerns such as other parts of the genetic code becoming mutated. Thus further research is needed before the experiment becomes routine practice. The Korean researchers of the study, meanwhile, stressed that it paved a new way for preventing incurable genetic disorders and highlighted the necessity of changing the nation's law on bioethics. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.